Something Blue is yet another comedy-focused episode in Season 4, the fourth and the first nine. It certainly makes this season have a relatively unique tone, but not necessarily for the better. It's all about Willow and dealing with the fallout from Oz leaving. This makes the timing of Pangs even more suspect, as there was not even a reference to Oz in the last episode. However, retroactively making other episodes worse isn't the fault of this one, so it's best to take it as it is. Here Willow tries a number of different coping methods to deal with her feelings. Denial is the first, something that Spike sees through immediately, although the other Scoobies have a harder time. It's actually one of Spike's most consistent traits, his high emotional intelligence, perhaps a reference to his pre-vamp days as a poet. Next, Willow is simply depressed, crashing Buffy and Riley's picnic. Their relationship is still in an uncertain place, as it's clear they're both interested, but hesitant due to their monster-slaying obligations. There are some deeper cracks, however, but those won't really be addressed until next season, so for now they're content to have nice experiences together. Willow then opts to drown her sorrows in beer, which is treated pretty much the same as beer bad. Everything else failed, Willow turns to black magic, creating a spell that will make her will take place. Once again, Buffy's magic is incredibly powerful, with no real restrictions in place. While this spell is relatively uncontrollable, she is able to teleport people, mind control them, and in general cause an incredible amount of havoc. Much of the humor of the episode comes from these twisted genie wishes. The first is simply causing Giles to slowly become blind, although it's odd the effect is delayed, whereas all the other ones seem relatively instantaneous. Then she says that Spike and Buffy should get married, which they subsequently plan. It also involves them falling in love, which doesn't seem like part of the initial wish, but as it said before, Buffy magic is odd. This particular point seems like it was poking fun at the shipping community. It was intended to show that Spike and Buffy would never work together. Until season 6 at least. About half the episode is devoted to them planning their wedding, and other characters being grossed out by their affections. Xander is then called a demon magnet, and is forced to fight a bunch of demons, which is a bit more straightforward. In the end, Willow is offered the role of a vengeance demon, just like Anya used to be, although she declines. To Offren, who we've seen previously, is surprisingly chill about this, which fits the comedy focus of the episode, and then everything is just made okay again. Overall, Something Blue is a fairly substandard Monster of the Week episode. The only interesting thing is the monster is Willow's magic on Rogue, rather than third party. It doesn't contribute hugely to the character arcs, aside from Willow now being over Oz, and generally is just a bit of a letdown. Next episode, however, is exactly the opposite, and arguably the best in the series. Tune in soon for that one.